Welcome back everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Uncanny Valley. We've just uh, gotten our new job at the facility and I've fallen asleep in the toilets because we were too tired. And now I'm guessing this is the dream we're having. So, uh, hmm. I don't know where we are, but I love the graphics. Do we have inventory here? Yes, we do. What are all those pipes? Well, obviously it's a dream, so... Uh, whoa. I'm gonna keep my stamina for later, if I need it. What's this? Can I crouch? How do I... Wait, how do I crouch? Uh... Oh. How do I... I used to... Oh, wait. How did I do that now? E? F? Oh, down! Ugh. <laughs> Just press... What the hell was that? Oh crap, it's one of those things. What the hell? That's freaky. Hello. Uh-oh. Why did it zoom out? What? Huh. Huh. Holy crap. Okay, so we're actually back in bed. <laughs> He's tired. I really shouldn't s sleep on the job, but I'm really tired. Day one. What's this? Okay, now let's get... Uh, meet me in the re relaxation room tonight. Second floor, first door on the left. Second floor, first door on the left. Okay. Hope I'll remember that. Probably won't. Well, he said tonight. Well, we can still try, though. Let's see. No, it's locked. Alright, let's get to our, uh, to our station. It seems like there's some kind of a timer in the game. Where, you know, you actually start getting tired and such, and your shift is over. That's quite interesting. And we keep getting the night shift. Damn. Ugh, it's very dark. Yeah, this is, this is, you know, ominous here. That we have to go through this place. Alright. Melior. Let's get back over there. Well, let's do our run. Oh, he's here. The gods have graced us with your presence. If you're late again, I'm waiting a f uh, writing a formal complaint to our boss. Get to work. Bye. Oh, was I late? But I got here as soon as I could. Right, first floor, first. I haven't even... I, I barely checked this place. Wait, so... Okay, they don't turn on by themselves. You have to turn them on. Okay. That's fine. So it just means that I have to press on every computer I see. Uh, Damien said you forgot your key card. I went by the AI office today, but you weren't there, so I left it with James. Here you had a good time. I uh, hope you had a good time the other night. We sure did. Sorry, the font is a little iffy. Um, consider this your first warning. I'll be keeping the key card with me for now. If you need... If you need it, come and pick up it up at the beta. If I'm not at the desk, come by the apartments. You know where to find me. And don't pester James. Unlike David, the previous guy, he's actually doing a good job. Thank you for subscribing to Adult Swing Entertainment. If you're ready to start searching for that perfect swing, put on your dancing shoes and follow this link. If you would like to cancel your subscription, click here. Well, this was a night to remember. Things don't usually slip my mind, but I think I forgot my keycard at your place. Could either you or Linda drop it by today? I'm gonna need it tomorrow, thanks. Oh, that's another one. The hospital yesterday... Oh, wait. 
So we finished installing their medical scanning equipment a couple of days ago, and guess what? The thing found... Okay, we know that. Yeah, I know, it surprised me as well when we got the first one running. It knows who we are because of the staff database. I'm having trouble believing it myself. A lot of people are going to have their lives improved because of the thingamabobs. We just started working on their vital sign recognition and medical scanning equipment. Thank you for bringing the keycard by today. I was in a hurry, so I couldn't say much. But don't worry about Peter being mad. He is going to be uh, hearing from me. He's supposed to have that keycard with him at all times, and he goes and loses it. I hope he doesn't lose his marbles too, so we don't have to let him go as well. What? The guy who replaced David was as useful as a bucket full of hair. He kept watching anime and sat on his ass most of the time. I still find it shocking that... That thingamabob recognized me and started talking to me. Okay, that, we've already read that one. Even by train, if I come... Oh, wait. <laughs> hey, buddy, how's everything going at the job? I met Taylor the other day, and she said you guys are keeping quite busy over there? We should meet up. Taylor said the facility you work is quite a ride, even by train. If I come for the weekend, you could show me around the city and we could do some catching up. Let me know what you think. Hey, we wrote some new algorithms, we've already read that. Oh man, I haven't seen you in ages. Work is going fine, I'm just kind of skeptical if we're crossing some ethical or moral line with this work. I know I'm being vague, but I'm under contract and can't say much about what we're doing. Sadly, there's practically nothing to see here. It would take our, uh, you way too much time to even get here, so I think it's better if we get together when I'm on vacation. I think I'll be off in July. Take care. Or he'll be dead. That's a big monitor up there. Okay, everything good here. I used to be able, in the demo, I used to be able to, um... To check these signs over here, but now I can't. For some reason. Oh, what's this? Oh, that's a tape. Oh, this is big now. Hey, Damien, Jonathan gave me your email. Uh, we're archiving this week's recordings. Could you bring everything over to the lab so we can index everything for the AI guys and archive it? Thanks. Well, this was a night to remember. Things are usually... I already saw this. I just got back from a meeting with the staff and the CEO. The company is running into financial troubles. Her funding is getting cut. You know what that means? We're gonna be able to start a life together. No more hiding around from the rest of the people here. You're, in, you're such a coward. I knew it was just a fling with you. And your wife, Linda? She confronted me the other day saying I forced you into it? Jeez, you're such a pussy. Must be funny being you, no matter who you are partner up with. You always get fucked in the ass. <laughs> yeah, no problem, Adam. I'll bring it over tomorrow. Just make sure you have two tablespoons of HDD... Oh, terabytes of HDD space ready for everything. Well, you know, you might use tablespoons as well. I don't know. Uh, the new guy you got is a real pansy. I ended up doing his work for him because he was too afraid of messing up the database. We've seen that. Oh, what's this? Press enter to listen to the selected tape. May the 11th, 2013. Hello, Doctor. Hello. How are you feeling today? Fine. It's fun being with you. How are you? Busy as ever, I'm afraid. What do you think of your new home? It's perfect. Doctor, is there any way I could help you? It would be no We're trouble. We're going to be seeing each other quite a bit over the next few weeks. I'm hoping that you can cooperate with me and answer some questions. Of course. Let's begin with some basic questions. Mm. What day is it? It's Monday. Good. And do you know the time? 10.05 a.m. Great. And what's the square root of 3,844? 62, Doctor. Impressive. Where are you from, dear? Can you remember? What's your name? I feel... Answer my questions. What the hell? What are you feeling? Are you alright? Sorry. I'm fine, Doctor. How may I help you? What the hell's going on there? And damn, I'm gonna fall asleep again. I gotta go to the relaxation room with that guy. What the hell was going on there? I wanted to say, uh, you know, the, um, the voice actress delivery is a bit stale, but actually it might have been on purpose. She was comp sort of out of it, like a robot. That was weird. Right, please don't fall asleep here. 
I need to get to the relaxa relaxation room. On the second floor, first door on the left, I, be I believe. Quickly, before I fall asleep. Bim! Come on. Uh, second floor. No. Ah, oh, no! I thought it was here! Damn it. This is that guy's place. Damn, I thought it was here. Was it third floor? No, it was... Or was it first floor? I get confused so easily. My short-term memory sucks. And before I fall asleep... Let's go and see. The shifts are a bit too quick. Uh-oh. There we go. I'm falling asleep. Damn it. There's only a limited amount of time each day, apparently. Ooh. Money! I have money now? You okay in there, buddy? <laughs> Yay! Relax! Want another one, Tom? I'll be five dollars. Yep. Fuck off. <laughs> Well, can't you see we're talking here? Leave us alone. Go away, creep. Oh, there we go. I'm gonna dance. That's a crappy song. <laughs> Damn, I just wasted a dollar. Chikorika bar. Hello. Hey, mister. Can you spare some money? Yeah, there you go. I just gave you money. Hey, fuck you. I'm hungry. I just gave you money. Oh. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh. Man. Those nightmares. They suck. Well, let's get changed. Day two. So I didn't get to meet the uh, the other guy, Buck, or whatever it was, because I forgot where the secure uh, the re relaxation room was. Damn it! <laughs> All right, let's do our shift again. At night, of course. Those nightmares are freaky. I wonder if they're they're actually gonna be reality. Well, I don't know. We're gonna find out. Let's go back to the thing. Now the annoying thing is the uh, the shifts are very short, so you really need to hurry. And apparently, oh, am I late again? No, please take another ten minutes. I'm happy to do your job and stop sneaking back into your room during your shift for naps or whatever. I live just above you and I hear everything. Have fun working. What an ass. Hmm. Right, so first floor still, right? I haven't, I haven't finished it yet. Oh, there's nothing else here, okay. So that was the first floor. Let's go check out the second floor. What's on the second floor? Yeah, I'm not able to uh, read those signs. Hmm. I want to conserve my stamina. This is the cafeteria. But, um... Ooh, another... Whoa! Hello, Tom? Can you hear me? I was taking a piss, and I noticed the lights went out. It happens during the winter sometimes. You need to get to the generator hut. It's located past the apartments. Just keep walking to the right, you'll see it. Then go to the control panel, I left further instructions there. It's really easy, even if you could do it. If you don't, I'll fix it up in the morning, but I will stop being Mr. Nice Guy. Okay, let's, uh, let's go do it ourselves. That's dark. I don't like that we lose the flashlight when we run. 
Alright, ground floor. Bloody hell, it's dark. I'm just running and, you know, turning on the flashlight. Holy crap, that's pretty cool, actually. Okay, nothing here. Let's go. Why is it so dark outside? Well, I guess we are doing the night shift. Okay. <laughs> Hopefully my shift won't be over yet. But I need to keep walking. Why does the flashlight turn off every time I change the screen? That's a little annoying. Okay, there's the generator room. What's that? Oh, connect the dots like so. You can't make two connections through the same pair of dots. What? You can't make two connections through the same pair of dots. So it's like, do everything in one line? Is that it? Let's see. Wait, what? Okay. Yeah. I don't want to mess with... with this. Okay, there we go. It's working again. Yay! And my flashlight wasn't working for a moment. Now, do I go back, or will I be too sleepy? I'm guessing I'll be too sleepy for it. So that generator actually seems to power the entire area, not just the facility, but the uh, apartments as well and everything. That's kind of concerning. Disconcerting. So do I actually need to go back to sleep in the bed, or can I just always fall asleep here? Hmm. Okay. Well, that seemed like I had a little more stamina there. Okay, so let's go this way. Did we already go all the way this way? I don't think we did. Let's check it. Nope, we didn't. Because the power shut off right there. Ah, oh, but there's nothing else here. Damn it. I'm wasting my time. Let's go to the other area. Yeah, he seems to have a little more stamina now, but maybe that's just my, you know, perception. Uh-oh. Why did the music stop? Oh, is this the relax- Oh, this is the relaxation room. What the hell's going with that anarchy thing? Yeah, this is the relaxation room. I thought it was in the apartments. It's here. Damn. <clears throat> I'm a little concerned why the music stopped there, though. But anyway. This is the alpha, and we're gonna continue next time. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.